me take you back to a time when Love was as precious as diamonds Where if you search you would find it What are you doing? Nothing. You said with a pout face and voice was a little bit annoyed. Jungkook signed as he understand you are still angry on what happened yesterday. It was your wedding anniversary and he was on mission. He didn't even care to call you or text you at least one. Jungkook signed. How about going out for dinner? What are you doing at night? Nothing. He signed hearing this nothing from you. He apologized a lot of time but you are not ready to listen to him and now he is just tired he can't stay without talking to you but this time it seems hard to make it up with you he signed and again looked at you yen what are you wearing tonight nothing yeah he laughed while you unangly got up switching off the television you were about to walk away but he grabbed your arm and pulled you back on the couch and hovered over you making your eyes widen yeah what are you doing he peeked your lips making you swallow yeah you he again kissed you this time you pressed your lips together not to want to utter a word and again end up getting kissed by him it's not the first time he is like this since the morning keep on kissing you to ask for apologize by this time you made up your mind that you won't forgive him that easily we can't bring the day back so please just stop it i really want to remember but that mission got stuck in my mind i'm really sorry you know that i don't like when you get angry with me or give me this stupid silent treatment it's so childish we can't bring the day back but we made you realize so that you won't repeat that again right we can do this much If you keep on behaving like this then I will keep on kissing you then don't complain me later do whatever you want to do this time it's not going to be easy Mr John Jungkook wow from hubby to Mr John Jungkook wow you really make a long jump you looked away while he bit his lower lip think of it Ryan I won't show any mercy I don't have to think Before you could complete your sentence he placed his lips on yours and kissed you deeply making your eyes widen you tried to push him but he was too strong to push to back yeah are you mad i'm sorry yan please oh sam oppa he looked back and you take it as a chance pushing him you ran from there standing a little far from him you looked at him and stick out your tongue Never Mr Mafia You said and ran from there he smiled and lay down on the bed You are inviting a devil by your own my princess I don't care Mr Beast Yeah yeah I remember it all but this time it's hard for me to join you all Yeah don't tell me that your husband won't allow you she said in a irritated voice while you smiled a little well you can say that i think there's some gam preparing to attack on them so you know mafia thing we don't understand that you said slowly and slowly stepping on the stairs i never understand how you end up falling for a mafia is it really that romantic It's too much that they won't even remember your wedding anniversary. He just proposed me in such a way that I fall for him instantly, more quicker than making Maggie. But I didn't knew that this romantic man had lots of sides. You should talk to him. Maybe he will drop you. Well, these days we are not talking to each other, but still, if it's for you, then I will talk to him. Please Fayan without you it's going to be all empty you chuckle slightly and nodded Don't hang up he is there i will talk to him you quickly walk downstairs when you saw Jungkook coming inside while talking to his bodyguards Jungkook Daisy is asking me to join school reunion party then am i allowed it no 
Take up your right cheek and pick your lips. I'm sorry. Just this much. And he walked in his room smiling while the bodyguard cleared their thought and followed him. You were standing there like a statue, but Daisy voice bring you back. Hey, what he said? Boy, wait. He don't even feel shy doing all this in public. Oh God, I'm going to go crazy one day. Yeah, what's wrong? He looked at your phone and sighed. You signed and was about to take off your towel to wear your clothes, but the door knob twisted and Jungkook walked in, making your eyes go widen. Jungkook, towel, knock. He looked at you and smiled. You are taking shower this time. What's so special? Yeah, don't you have manners? Knock before entering in, in a bathroom. Wow, that's really a great system you introduced. He said, washing his hand and looking at you through mirror. But at least just ask if someone is inside or not. You just bag in. My missus, you are the one who should lock the door before going to take shower. It's me. Anyone can enter like this. Then what will you do that time in our room? Seriously? He wiped his hand with a towel and nodded. Yes, seriously. Don't eat up my mind and go out from here. I need to change or else I will catch cold. He walked near you making your breath stuck in your throat. It's so childish to catch cold if you stay without clothes. People stay without clothes whole night, then also they won't catch cold. You are getting what I mean, right? Dirty mind? He smiled when you hit his chest. Well, you can change your clothes here or if you still not done, then we can take shower together. I'm going to take shower. He take off his shirt, making your eyes widen, his well-built body and his left arm covered with tattoos, and the most beautiful thing, your name tattooed on his chest near his heart. Don't you feel ashamed taking off your clothes anywhere you want? You are my wife, and it's not like you are seeing me shirtless for the first time. And even if you, then don't be shy, one day we have to see each other like this. You took on your saliva and looked at him. Seriously, Jungkook? Yes, seriously, I am so hot. You signed, but suddenly something make your eyes widen. You grabbed Jungkook's arm and pushed him out. He looked at you confused. Take your shirt and go out. Go out. What happened? Nothing. Go out. You pushed him out and locked the door. Chunko give you a tissue while you wipe your tears and nose with it. He smiles slightly but quickly come up with a stressed face because he knows it's not a good idea. He then again give you the tissue and then again and again. This thing continue until he feels like the tissue box get empty. There's no more tissue left. Should I take out the new pack? No need. That annoyed and angry tone was still visible in your voice which make his heart melt. Is it paining a lot? You pouted like a child and nodded. It's all your fault. You make me angry, so that's why I got my periods. He raised his brows. Really? This also happened because of me? I thought this time of month is always goes like this. You always got your periods around this time. Then how is it my mistake? Don't know, but it's all your mistake. He shrimmed. Okay, so it's my mistake and you want me to fix this now, right? You nodded multiple times. He chuckled and softly peeked your lips making your cheeks turn red and your eyes widen. It's not like he kissed you for the first time but whenever he kisses you, you always feel a different sensation in your body. Why? Because little bunny is in pain and I can't see her suffering. Only if I could able to take her pain, then she might be sleeping peacefully now. But sadly, I can't do anything. You can feed me ramen. You said pointing towards the bowl he cooked for you. Yeah, it's better if you eat something. After that, you have to take medicine too. It's okay. I don't take medicines when I am on my periods. It's not a good, you know. 
He looked at you and smiled. Don't worry, this medicine is healthy for you and sweet too. Really? What type of medicine it is, which is sweet and healthy too? He looked at you and softly peeked your lips, making your eyes widen. It's sweet, isn't it? He asked, looking at you. You scrunched your nose and looked at him. It stink. E really? I think you didn't smell it properly. Let me kiss you again. He leaned to kiss you again, but you put your hand on his mouth, making him confused. No need, and don't forget that I'm still angry on you. How you forget our anniversary? Like, are you serious, man? You just know how to kill people. You are not any less. You know how to kill hearts, just like you kill mine. You didn't say anything and looked away while he peeked your lips again. You didn't react and just looked away. Stop it, Vyan. There are so many days. How am I supposed to remember all of them? The day we saw each other, the day we smiled at each other, the day I proposed you, the day we got married, and our birthdays. And it's just the start. Don't know how many are coming next. Then go to hell. Come with me then, because I know heaven won't accept you. He said and placed a peek again on your lips. You kiss me again. Aish, what's wrong with you, dude? I will keep on kissing you. Just accept my apologies or enjoy it. You, you said while pointing your index finger at him while he just smiled slightly and moved closer to you. You gulp and move a little backward. Put your finger down or I will kiss it too. You quickly put your hand down making him smile. Why what? The word just slipped from your mouth but Jungkook took it seriously. His eyes became dark while you looked at him confused. Raising his brows he started to lean in while you started to lean back. Yeah, what are you doing? You just call me Parvit, then let me show you the real side of Parvit people. Don't kiss me, I'm angry on you. He peeked your lips. Yeah, he peeked again. Jungkook, he just shimmicked and now you got trapped in his broad arms. He started to lean closer while you moved your face to the other side. Suddenly you feel a sudden pain in your stomach making you hissed. He said properly and looked at you worried. What happened? Are you okay? Aish, it hurts. Jungkook, let's continue this tomorrow. I'm in so much pain. Let's sleep now and don't forget that I'm still angry on you. So it's better you make it a plan to make it up with me. Let me help you. He said covering you with a blanket and placing a pillow near your stomach. I never got this type of pain before and you even know nothing of this. Then how? Leave everything on me. Just take some deep breath and wait for me. I will be really quick. And don't worry my princess, there's no need for tomorrow. I will make it up with you today itself. He said and peeked your forehead. He ran down making you smile slightly. You slowly lay down on the bed resting your head on the soft mattress. Door opened after some time. You lift your head up and saw Jungkook come while holding lots of things in his hands. He closed the door with his leg and walked to you. You got up to help him but he stopped you. Stay there. I will do it by myself. You lay down again and smiled slightly. I don't know which one is best but I take all the things I saw you using on your periods. That's too much. Only hot water will work. He looked at you again started to arrange things. It's because this time your pain is also worse. He extends heat pads towards you. Take it and put it on your stomach. I knew it. It's not like it's the first time I saw this or I never used anything like this before. In case you forgot. You scoffed. Here, it's hot water for you and I already put ginger slice in it and even sugar. He said giving you the bowl. You smiled and took a sip and your face scrunched. What happened? Is it that bad? Spicy. A lot. His face scrunched in confusion. He took a sip from the same bowl and bite his lower lip. Taking a deep breath, he looked at you. I think I need to put some sugar in it. 
He said and put more sugar, one spoon, two, and was about to put third one. Yeah, stop it. He looked at you confused while you pressed your lips together. After a while, you spoke. It's too much. He nodded and gave you the bowl again. You blow some air and took a sip and a wide smile danced on your lips. He smiled too. How is it? Sweet. Wanna try some? You will like it. You said extending the bowl at him but instead he leaned closer to you and kissed you. It's really sweet. Now is my apologies accepted? These two are two different things my hubby, so no, you are still sinner in my eyes. And the sinner is craving for his wife's love. Let's end it here. You shook your head making him giggle. He nodded and sat on the bed resting his back on the headboard and pulled you between his legs. You smiled when your back touched his chest. He wrapped his arm around your waist and put his chin on your shoulder. Since when my wifey started to behave like a hot to get girl, since you broke her heart by not remembering such a big day, do I mean nothing in your life? He softly placed a kiss on your neck, making you close your eyes automatically by a chill feeling. You are my world, my everything, he whispered. Then why you forget our wedding anniversary? Well, let's put a full stop on this fight and let's solve it with talk. My dear wifey, when your phone is going one day ahead, then try to look at the calendar we had in our room. Our anniversary is today, not yesterday. You looked at him shocked and then scoffed. You really think it's that easy to make me fool? No, Mr. John Jungkook. Except your smile, nothing works on me. So it's better you. You stop and bowed it when he placed a kiss on your lip. You really talk the rot. My darling, look at the date in my phone. He said giving you his phone. You looked at the screen and your eyes widened. You quickly turned back and looked at the calendar placed on the night table and you bite your lower lip. Internally slapping yourself, you sit back in his arms. He again hugged you pulling you deep in his arm while your face turned all red. I can never forget things which make my pumpkin happy. You pouted and looked down playing with your finger. If I were with a mistake then you should tell me this earlier so that we can plan something. Look, we end up wasting our time for nothing. If I tell you this earlier, then how I will enjoy this beautiful day, simple yet breathtaking, is the bestest anniversary of ours. You really make it so special. You part it. You are making fun of me, don't you? He smiled softly and shook his head. Not this time. I really enjoy my day and about making it special. Then, with you, my everyday is special. I don't need this special day to celebrate with you. You are so adorable. Not more than you. And guess what? You look more adorable when you get sick. Yeah, here I am in pain and you are making fun of my situation. Aini, I'm telling you the fact. You smile and tighten his grip on your waist. You should tell me earlier, Jungkook, I was just getting angry on you for nothing. Even though you take full advantage of my dead side, but that's okay. But if you tell me earlier, then I might brought some gift for you. Return my kisses, that's the only precious thing you can do. You chuckle and turn to look at him. Really, only a kiss will be okay for you. You don't want anything more. I will take care of that. Just kiss me for now. You smile and cupping his right cheek, you kiss his left cheek, making him smile. Happy anniversary, my dear hubby. You too, Mrs. John.